टपिक हल स्टेबिलिटी अब दरप्लें Do you guys know what is stability at all? Sir, I force a tug balance. No, that is not stability. The stability is actually shown here. If a statically, if a static system, otherwise a stable system that is changed. <clears throat> from its original position then three things may occur it can tend to come back to its original position as per the first figure then the system is called statically stable it may go on changing and changing and changing and gun then it is statically unstable and for the third case it will move to another position and then again become static that is called statically neutral system is this figure clear to you i think it is very easy yes sir <clears throat> so this is the static stability condition and along with static stability there is one thing called dynamic stability See, both the things are actually shown here. This displacement is the initial disturbance. So this dis displacement is nothing but this displacement, the initial disturbance, and it tend to come back. But when it tends to come back, are you sure that it will very beautifully come and come and come and be here only? or it will overshoot at first and then again come back what is your perception say so it will overshoot and then come back there sir, is some something like oscillation like motion sir yes so the second figure is uh, very much likely is na that it will overshoot and then again as it is statically stable it is again disturbed so it will again try to come back and in this way once upon a time it will come back to its original position right right sir and for the ideal case there is no overshoot and it will very smoothly come back to its original position but both the cases are statically stable as well as dynamically stable but there can be a typical case where even a statically stable system is not dynamically stable you see here the overshoot is more than the initial disturbance it is not very likely to occur but obviously there can always be a possibility it is not very likely to occur that from the initial disturbance the overshoot is higher it is not very customary but still as far as theoretical discussion is concerned this is also a possibility na so what happens from the over from the initial disturbance the overshoot is more so again from the over should it tries to come back cause it is statically stable and then the next over should is even more and if in this way it goes on 
then once upon a time it will become unstable isn't it yes sir so this is called dynamic instability it was statically stable it is still statically stable after disturbance it tends to come back to its original position every time it tends to come back to its original position but as the overshoot is more than the initial disturbance that makes it dynamically instable so is static and dynamic stability conditions clear to you guys or not yes sir yes sir now for an airplane let us actually uh, forget about this particular slide okay let me actually clear you when and where the stability of the airplane really matters at the time of take off the airplane is in the control of the pilot okay but when it actually retains the highest elevation then what happens at the highest elevation point the airplane is moving forward only it is not moving upward or downward at all yes or no yes sir so that total force and moment system at least the total moment on the airplane is balanced yes sir and the total vertical force is also balanced because it is yes, not sir. moving upward or downward it is only yes, moving forward lift is balancing yes, weight na sir yes lift is balancing the weight lift is balancing the weight i mean the yes. total lift is balancing the total weight yes sir yes sir and also the moments are balanced yes or no yes sir only the forward thrust is greater than the total drag and that makes the flight moving forward yes sir engine thrust will be greater than drag yes <clears throat> so in this particular condition you know there are flights for 7 to 8 hours or even more 16 to 17 hours flights are also there that that is from india if we consider and if we consider from other countries even more flight times are there so what happens it is impossible for a pilot to control the flight for the complete period of aviation generally there are two pilots in a flight a pilot and a second pilot or co pilot we say one co pilot and for long duration flights there are always one second officer who is the third pilot who can control the flight but at the highest elevation when the highest elevation is reached and the total moment is balanced the airplane is said to be trimmed you see in this particular say that the total the airplane is said to be trimmed where the total moment about cg is zero and so also the coefficient of moment so in this streamed condition it generally occurs that the main pilot goes on having a nap keeping the airplane in autopilot mode and it is true the copilot is there 
in case of any difficulty he or she will just try to control the airplane on his or her own otherwise in case of further difficulty he will ask the copilot he will ask the main pilot to wake up and control so for long duration flight a long time the flight system is under autopilot and that is not done at the time of take off at the time of descent but it is done when the airplane is at the highest elevation and it is only moving forward in a trimmed condition is this particular thing clear to you or not yes sir so the stability and other aspects mostly matters in this particular condition when it is not under the direct control of the pilot it is in the autopilot mode okay when jet airways was there a brussels bound flight of jet airways i forgot the number that actually due to some reason came down 5000 feet all of a sudden under autopilot then the air traffic control person warned the copilot that what happened your flight is not moving correctly it has come down 5000 feet and the copilot got jumbled up then the auto the main pilot was waken up and he took care of the rest uh, it was actually reported in the dgci the director general of civil aviation that this particular thing happened so under autopilot mode it is very important that the airplane stability is maintained anyway so first of all aerodynamic center you all know right i have mentioned that what is aerodynamic center a particular point on the cord line about which the moment is constant that is it is independent of the angle of attack this particular thing you already know yes or no yes sir sir okay now if i show you that particular equation once again and explain a single thing then this particular thing may be a bit easier for you to understand let me find out that particular equation that i showed you but right now i need to find it out again <clears throat> the equation that we encountered at the time of knowing the center of pressure and aerodynamic center without showing you this equation i cannot actually explain this particular slide i should have kept the equation in the slide itself but he has i forgot so i need to have it here to so see here equation 1.22 is already shown to you right yes sir that moment about the leading edge is given by this moment about any point can be there in this particular figure the point at c by 4 is shown and accordingly the equation becomes m c by 4 plus Minus c by four into l. Yes or no? Yes, sir. 
consider when lift is zero when lift is zero can we say m dash l equal to m dash c by 4 yes sir and c by 4 we have taken in a random way isn't it yes sir if it would have been c by 2 it is it would have been c by 3 the case would have been same yes sir that i mentioned na if it is c by 2 it will be c by 2 into l dash so if l dash is 0 then m dash l equal to m dash c by 4 m dash c by 2 m dash of any point yes or no yes sir yes sir and that is why here it is written they had zero leaf moment of any point is constant i mean moment of any point is equal to is actually equal moment about leading edge is equal to moment about any point let it be c by 4 let it be aerodynamic center anything uh, but sir uh, practically it is feasible na to yes practically it is feasible feasible if uh, if if zero lift is there if zero lift is there, then it is visible. But obviously, at the trimming condition, it is not there. Or at the trimming condition, there must be some lift to balance the weight. But it is just a definition. It is not related to the trimming condition. Okay. Are you convinced that at zero lift this will happen? Yes or no? Yes, sir. The equation will be satisfied, sir. Yes. And also, see, there are two points. At zero lift, moment about any point is constant. Yes or no? Yes, sir. And at zero lift, Moment about the aerodynamic center is also the same because it is one of the moment obviously. As that is constant, so moment about aerodynamic center is also that. Yes, sir. And moment about aerodynamic center is by definition also constant. So it won't change with the angle of attack. Yes, sir. So if we can find the zero lift moment, we can say that is the moment about the aerodynamic center. See if this is clear to you or not. Clear, sir. Other guys, please mention. Is it clear to you or not? Yes, sir. So yes, this sir. is a very quick way to find out. Okay, uh, this is a very quick way to find out the moment about the aerodynamic center. That is, at zero lift, if we find out the moment, we can say the zero lift moment is equal to the moment of, of the aerodynamic center, and so also the coefficient. Now you see this particular figure where all the forces and moments are shown. Obviously, you may ask me that along with lift at tail, there must be some drag at tail. And as the tail is also an aerofoil, there must be some MAC of tail also. Why they are not shown? Now, you will come across this particular thing later that the drag of tail is very small and also the moment about aerodynamic center of the tail is also very small. That is why they are omitted, but the lift of tail is significant for the moment generation. That is why only lift of tail is shown. The other two things, that is the drag of tail and the MAC of tail are not shown. And you see for the wing, as per our conviction, we have taken the forces 
to be act on the aerodynamic center along with the moment about the aerodynamic center okay <clears throat> so is this particular figure clear to you or not yes sir okay now we have another consideration as we already know that even at no uh, last figure t ta ki chilo last figure t t what is t, t is t? the thrust forward thrust forward engine thrust okay sir that will be there na that i told you that the when the thrust is greater than the drag it will move forward yes yeah, sir obviously sir okay now we already know na that even at zero angle of attack there are some lift so in order to have a zero lift condition we must place the aerofoil at a small negative angle of attack yes or no yes are ki kotha bol yes sir sir hobe sir that particular small negative angle of attack is shown here as alpha l equal to 0 clip ta ke zero ko korar jonno tai to ha jodi lip zero korte hoy if we if we if we require the lip zero condition keno ki mane zero le zero angle of attack teo to kichu lip thake zero angle of attack e kichu lip thake clear sir and in this particular condition a line is drawn parallel to the v infinity and this line we call the zero lift line cause we may say that when the zero lift line is parallel to v infinity the lift is zero obviously and with the help of this zero lift line we define the absolute angle of attack how you see the second figure if instead of with the quad line the angle with the zero lift line is shown then that angle is called the absolute angle of attack and what is the significance of this you see when the absolute angle of attack is zero the lift is obviously zero isn't it yes sir that two figures i think it is very clear anybody having any problem no sir so what is the significance of this absolute angle of attack that is the absolute angle of attack is obviously given by the geometric angle of attack plus that alpha l equal to 0 and if we actually plot cl versus alpha a that is the absolute angle of attack we get this particular curve <coughs> that actually starts from the or actually goes through the origin for the geometric angle of attack that actually gives the angle with the chord line it is not going within the origin to the origin but here it goes through the origin so in general we may say that if the absolute angle of attack is zero the lift is zero डिफाइन कर Angle of attack is the angle between v infinity and the chord line. Yes. Yes, sir. 
and absolute angle of attack is the angle of attack is the angle between the v infinity and the zero leaf line bolte hi bari oshubidhar kichu nei yes so if this angle is zero lift is zero that is obvious clear sir alpha a is zero zero lift line is parallel to v infinity and the lift is zero obvious obviously sir. सर तो क्वार्ट लाइन तक के रेफरेंस एक्सिस नहीं है ना बोलना क्वार्ट लाइन क्योंकि नेगेटिव तो, नेगेटिव तो ये जो तो कोम हॉरिजेंटल लाइन रहती है अकॉर्डिंग तू वी इनफिनिटी वो नेगेटिव डायरेक्शन है होल्डर जीरो लिफ्ट होती है एक बम हम्म तो ये जो नेगेटिव नेगेटिव डायरेक्शन तक जो लाइन तक दी जाती ह� কিন্তু এখন কি বলেছি এখন বলেছি ওই নেগেটিভিটি ধাত থেকে বাঁচবো তাই জন্য ওই নেগেটিভ অ্যাঙ্গেল অফ অ্যাটাকের সময় যে লাইনটা ভি ইনফিনিটির প্যারালাল সেটাকে আমরা জিরো লিফ লাইন ডিফাইন করেছি না অন আছে এটা কি আর কি হচ্ছে ओके ओके इज इट ओके यस सर इज इट ओके यस सर ओके सर सो द एब्सोल्यूट एंगल ऑफ अटैक इज क्लियरली डिफाइंड यस सर एंड नाउ माय अजम्पशन कम that for my flight dynamics case when we actually deal with the actual flight system any angle of attack we say we actually say the absolute angle of attack okay bujha gelo kotha ta yes sir Just a second. Hello. Hey. One to four. A class meet you guys. Hmm. Acha. Anyway. Hmm. So from now onward. Any angle of attack we say, we mean the absolute angle of attack, okay? Okay, sir. This particular system is clear to you guys. Now let us see. What can be the variation of the CMCG with respect to the absolute angle of attack? As you have already seen that these CM lines are generally straight lines. Can I see it? Yes or no? Yes, sir. And for CMAC, the straight line is a parallel to x-axis, so it is constant. But for the other CMs, like this CMCG, that will be a straight line, but that will be obviously not constant. That will be varying. See that? how can we actually have a straight line the cmcg can be this starting from a positive value going to a negative value otherwise the cmcg can be this these are the two possibilities only due to the fact that there must be some angle of attack where the cmcg is zero cause otherwise these screaming condition won't be achieved at all ei kotha ta bojha geche kina bol ha sir so there must be some angle of attack some point where cmcg is zero and if that angle of attack is called the trim angle of attack alpha e then the curve of the cmcg can only be 
in two ways. One is this with a negative slope and one is this with a positive slope. Is this particular thing clear for you or not? That there are only two possibilities of CMCG versus alpha curve. Obviously, the values may change, but the nature of the curve are likely to be this. Is it clear or not? Yes, sir. Okay. Now let us see if this particular thing or this particular curve is there. Suppose the airplane is moving with this particular alpha e that is it is completely trimmed okay so it is moving at alpha e fine no problem with the first figure no sir now suppose some air gust has come from somewhere some air gust has come and it has caused the airplane a nose up condition फरवर्ड ऑन Is it all right? The airplane was moving forward only. The pilot has kept it in the autopilot mode and slept. Would you get it? Go that? Yes, sir. Please. Now somewhere an air gust comes and causes the flight to nose up. Boom! Go to the back camera. Some other guy is pushing the edge. Is it all right? Clear, sir. Now what happens? Your angle of attack is increased. Yes or no? Yes, sir. As per this particular graph, there will be some positive CMCG working. I know it. If alpha a is greater than alpha e, then the CMCG graph tells that the CMCG is positive. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And what is the meaning of positive CMCG? It means a nose up moment. Yes, sir. So the nose was already up, and further nose up moment actually start occurring. what happens to the airplane won't it become unstable unstable yes, ho jabe ki na unstable ho jabe to sir eta sobai convinced je eta unstable ho jabe yes sir thik er ulto condition ta bhab just follow the opposite case the air gust causes it to nose down in case of this obviously the angle of attack is less than alpha e yes or no yes sir and correspondingly a negative moment start occurring and the negative moment means further nose down and it will again become unstable yes or no yes sir so this particular curve Causes total instability of the flight system. So this curve is not preferred for a flight system. Is it clear to you or not? Clear, sir. So the opposite case, the possibility is this. you see for this particular curve 
just the opposite thing occurs when the air gust causes the air flight to move up the angle of attack is increased and as the angle of attack is greater than the trim angle of attack a negative moment start occurring yes or no yes sir sir and that will keep the airplane back to its original position obviously the other figure is also very easy to understand if the angle of attack is suddenly made left by an air gust a positive moment start occurring that will make it again at its original position so the equilibrium position can be maintained if this particular curve we may have is it clear to you guys or not clear sir so we say that the condition of static stability is cm0 what is cm0 you see this is the cm for alpha equal to 0 right or is ha sir and alpha equal to 0 means zero lift ha sir so the zero lift moment coefficient about cg must be positive and the slope of the curve must be negative these are the two necessary criteria for static stability and longitudinal balance is this particular thing clear to you or not clear sir Okay. Now we have to ensure that this particular curve is maintained, right? Follow that particular figure one thing. I am showing you that particular figure one thing. For zero lift, what are the contributors of the moment? কি মনে হয় বল স্যার মোমেন্টটা তো কনস্ট্যান্ট থাকে থ্রু আউট এট এনি পয়েন্ট না 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 দ্যাট ইজ দা এমএসসি এমসিজি ইজ নট গেটিং কনস্ট্যান্ট না यस सर यस এই এটা কি রকম কথা হলো যদি কনস্ট্যান্টই থাকবে তাহলে ওরকম কার পেলাম কি করে so who are the contributor of cmcg kon kon force gulo contributor ki mone hoy can weight contribute to cmcg no sir no no ইট 
for cm0 case the lift is zero yes sir yes sir so who are left out can the drag and thrust contribute much no sir they are also very close to cg yes yes sir so that two contributors are left one is mac yes mac is a contributor no problem l wing and l tail l wing for zero lift how can you have l wing see we are concentrating on this first criteria cm0 must be positive okay for cm0 case are you having l wing at all no sir only mac chhara instead of mac who is the sole contributor L tail only L tail. Are you guys convinced that for CM zero case, the two sole main contributors are M S C and L tail? Can I say this thing? सर एल विंग तक क्यों भाई बुझा क्या लोना सर एम जीरो माने कि एम जीरो माने कि एम एट अल्फा इक्वल टू जीरो ताई तो यस सर अल्फा इक्वल टू जीरो ते एल एल विंग थाक बे नो नो सर इट विल नॉट एजी सर क्लियर सर क्लियर ओके अलग ही दूर ही कंट्रीब्यूट आर ताई तो हाँ सर Aish, I have shown you the MAC curve. Did you see it, Jilamto? Yes, sir. What was the value? Money, Aachi. Money, me. What did you buy, Money? I like that, Aachi. You see the the moment coefficient curve, okay? What do they got? Che moment coefficient ta? Ja, show me one. Na na. The moment coefficient is positive or negative? The positive. Hey, hello, kore dek. मुमेंट कोफिसियंट इज बल नेगेटिव ओके हाँ सर 
that is always negative but what you require you require cm0 to be positive right তাই তো দেখা গেল নাকি রে Yes, sir. Now CM0 has only two contributors and one of them is by default negative. So that is great. And from this figure, what you suggest? Lift of tail, the L tail will provide the moment in which direction? right but our figure and corresponding curves suggest that both the contributors are providing negative moment for zero lift about the cg sai tore yes sir so we are heading towards this curve which is not very useful which will cause the airplane to be instable चेन्ज इ but obviously if we have a negative lift in tail it will be having a positive moment about the cg yes or no ha sir so people suggest that in order to have the stability this car this particular slide actually says what i have told that tmc is by default negative so how to achieve stability and balance and you see the figure a it says that the tail must have a negative lift if the tail is having a negative lift then the tail can actually provide some positive moment about the cg yes or no ha yes, sir and that is why the lift of tail is very important it is always a negative lift and the tail is actually set at a negative angle of attack which we say the tail setting angle now are you guys convinced that the negative part of the lift coefficient is also very important for some cases yes sir you saw in case of elevator also a negative lift is 
sometimes very required, very much required to have a pitch up moment and also for the tail itself, the total tail is actually kept at a negative angle of attack. So that it produces some negative lift that will ultimately generate a positive moment about the CG. Is this particular thing clear to you or not? Yes, Anybody sir. having any problem? Kire, you all. So no problem, sir. Okay. But some researchers had some problem. <clears throat> They told, ah, in an airplane, deliberately having some negative lift is not very useful, man. Then the others told, then what to do? They told, keep the tail instead of at the back, at the front. Okay, fine. Keep in this particular figure, we have a tail at the front end then a positive lift can actually produce a positive moment, isn't it? Yes, sir. And uh, a gentleman called Canard actually suggested this particular combination that if the tail with a positive lift, do not tell it tail, it is at the front end. So it is the horizontal stabilizer with a positive lift at the front end then it will have a positive lift as well as a positive moment. Some airplanes actually followed this rule. But then a problem occurred. What is the problem? You see, for the first figure, where the tail is at the back end, the free stream velocity is negotiated by the wing. But for the next figure, the free stream velocity will be negotiated by the tail, isn't it? Yes, sir. And Doesn't... behind the tail, behind this tail, obviously the velocity will be disturbed. It won't be V infinity at all. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then the wing will negotiate a disturbed flow. Yes, sir. So what actually happened is that, yes, we are having some lift in the tail also, some positive lift in the tail also. But this particular consideration actually caused a reduction of lift in the wing itself because the wing is actually negotiating a disturbed flow that actually caused a reduction of lift of the wing so ultimately this particular thing was not very beneficial for us suppose for the first case, the lift of wing is 5 kN and the negative lift in tail is suppose 500 N. For the next case, the 500 N positive lift was there. Okay. But the lift of the wing decreased at 2 kN. Then ultimately, there is a net decrease of the total lift. So the Connaught configuration of having the tail at the front end is not used nowadays. Even with a negative lift in tail, the first configuration provides better net lift than the other. Okay. Yes, sir.
but still the cannot configuration is a bit important for us because if you find the jet plane the fighter jet for those things actually the wing spans are very high uh, fighter jet dekhechis ontoto chobi te yes sir the wings are actually spread up to the end tai noy ki triangular yes, wings are used that actually are spread towards the left end dekhachi chobi many a time like this the jet planes are having the wing to be spanned to the back okay though this particular jet plane is having a position of keeping the tail sei je dutto tail dekha jacche but many a time the jet plane wings are so much spanned to the back that there are no place of having this particular tail then the tail for actually kept at the front as per the suggestion of canard kotha ta bojha gelo yes sir and as for the jet plane Uh, the weight is not very important though it uh, nowadays actually carries torpedo so this particular thing is required also but as high lift is required so the wing span is very high and then there is no part where we can actually provide the tail so sometimes the tails are provided at the front as suggested by canard and those things are called the canard airplane So up to this, is it clear or not? Yes, sir. So next class, we will follow the mathematical expressions regarding this particular thing. Up to this, we have only told that okay, fine. The tail will take care of the positivity to be required for CM zero. CM zero positive होते होंगे, right? So if the tail is kept in this negative lift, that can produce a positive lift. Positive, no, that can produce a positive moment about CG. But this positive moment must overcome the negative MAC, na? Na sir. The lift of tail is downward, so it will create a positive moment about CG. but mac is negative so the positive moment fight provided by the tail should overcome the mac to have a positive cm0 isn't it yes sir predominant hote hobe yes sir so some mathematics and some expressions are required that we will follow in the next class okay so okay, this from the question go So, as far as today's class is concerned, do you guys have any query? No, sir. Sir, आगे दिन वही leap टा बोल बैन बोले चले। उन टा बोलो बोले चिलाम? Leap, leap. आई बुझ दे बात चीना रे ओकी बोल चे? Leap, leap. তারও বলেছিলেন না মানে ক্লাসের শেষ দিকে কি মানে লিফটটা কিভাবে কি ক্রিয়েট হচ্ছে সেটা বুঝাবো আগে সাইটেরটা শেষ হয়ে যাক তারপর করব আচ্ছা 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 হ্যাঁ এর মাঝখানে ওটা ঢুকলে গুলিয়ে যাবে বাবা ঠিক আছে ও 
ओके सो स्टॉप प्रेजेंटिंग कर लाम एंड स्टॉप रिकॉर्डिंग कर लाम